right video number one from my YouTube. So, uh, the point of this, basically, for me, I started out doing leather craft a couple years ago, and uh, I decided I'm going to kind of move it to, instead of doing it just for myself, uh, there's a pretty big homeless community around Nashville, and so I'm going to start kicking down some leather to them as I was a dirty kid traveling with a backpack and a dog and a guitar myself for a while there. And I have several hustles, you know, making leather, making jewelry, uh, not making leather, making things out of leather. And uh, there's just a lot of kids, young, young people out there and dirty kids of all ages that just don't really have a hustle, don't really have any way to make money. And uh, I have a few people who get leather scraps from their jobs doing uh, car interior and, you know, all kinds of things. So my buddy Todd donated this big old box of leather I just got. And it's all, you know, random little scraps, but I figure I'm going to run down to Nashville later today. And uh, on my way, I'm going to pick up you know, probably like a hundred sewing needles and try to get myself a bunch of things that sinew and dental floss and things that are good for sewing, uh, thread wise, just needles and thread and drop off a bunch of these scraps. And I think about once a week, maybe twice a week, I'm going to start heading down and there's a camp. I'm helping these kids. I just, last week I helped these kids move out of their squat house, uh, right next to 12th and Porter downtown in Nashville and uh, moved them into a spot where the rail yard said it was actually totally okay with them if they used these woods to build a camp in. So a lot of these kids are actual kids, um, pretty young people that just have no way to make money, don't know what they're doing on the street, probably just had a bad home life or didn't feel free enough. That's what happened to me. Instead of going to college, I hit the road. So, my first little project here, just goofing around. Um, I'm trying to make what I can using minimal tools. Uh, this is going to be a phone case in a little bit. I'll post an update. Um, all I've used to make this so far is a razor blade and really helps to have a cutting board and uh i mean honestly doing that right there though i can tell you if if you're gonna invest 20 bucks into doing leather get a pair of leather scissors oh my god it makes it so much easier this kind of sucks but also for this one i will not be using a needle because i left all of my needles at my other shop I'm at the automotive shop right now, but I have a ton of leather on me, and I have a ton of razor blades for cleaning off, you know, surfaces for gaskets and whatnot, so I'm going to show kids what they can do with basically nothing but a way to cut the leather, and you can always find a piece of wire on the ground to use as a needle, so I'll show you how to do that in the next little bit here, but this is episode one of... Chico going out and hooking up the homies downtown. Um, if you'd like to like and subscribe or in any way, if you're around Nashville and you'd like to help the homeless, you can get a hold of me. And uh, I have several different friends who are into doing outreach around here that help people out. So if you're interested at all, just hit me up. Help your fellow people, my friends. Stay positive.